What you guys got another video here for you. In this one we're going to be looking at how we could create a recovery partition inside Windows 10. Now we're going to be using a free piece of software uh, from IOMI. Uh, it's a one key recovery version 1.2 and you can see here you can download this and this is going to be able to create a restore partition for us on our Windows 10 operating system. Now you've probably seen these when you've uh, bought a brand new laptop they've got a little tiny partition on them that you can use to restore your operating system back to uh, default settings when you first bought that computer. Now this is useful if you've got boot failure or system that's infected and you just want to roll back and go back to when you first bought the computer you can use it for that here okay and it's a free version to download. Now I've already downloaded it as you can see it's about 24.2 megabytes in size um, which isn't too bad and I've already installed it it's pretty straightforward just go through the process of installing that so what I'm going to do here is click on the uh, program and then open her up and click on the user ac uh, account control and say yes to this this will then open up the OMI one key recovery then you've got two options here you've got the recovery process and also the backup process we're going to do the backup process first and uh, what that's going to do is um, take care of all the partition for us and resize everything and make everything just how we want it. So I'm going to click on one key system backup. Once we get this open here, we've got two choices here. So you can back up system to another location or you can back up the system to IOMI one key recovery partition. This is recommended. This is the one we're going to be using. OK, I'm going to click next. And as you can see here, the program will create the recovery partition on the selected partition below which is our C drive okay so this is where we want to uh, set our recovery partition you've also uh, got this other little partition here don't worry about that so we're going to go start backup and then it's going to say backup about to start but some operations require computer to be rebooted into Windows PE automatically. Are you sure you want to continue? We're going to say yes to this. And we'll just let this load back up into our Windows PE. So we'll just let this load up now and you can see there that we could press F11 to recover our system. So once you got here you can then continue and just continue to the desktop and there we are back at our desktop and in the next video I'll show you how to recover your system using the OMI one key recovery so you can see here now if we right click on this let's see if it's a hidden uh, partition we're going to go to disk management here we're just going to let this populate and as you can see here we now have another partition installed onto our drive and it's called IOMI recovery partition so that's basically how you can set up an OMI recovery partition on a Windows 10 operating system. I hope this one helps you out, guys. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, then hit that like button. Also, hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up to date when I upload new videos. If you've got any problems with your computers or you've got any video requests, you can head over to my forum. It's free to join. You can just join up over there and join the community. If you haven't joined my uh, Facebook fan page, you can also go over there and do that as well. I will be doing the follow-up video for this on recovering uh, using IOMI recovery, uh, one key recovery partition. Okay, so thanks again for watching. Have a great weekend, guys. Bye for now.